Well, hello there, you wonderful humans, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Hope everybody's having a fantastic day. We're back. It's day six of our 100% Stardew Valley playthrough. We're in spring. We don't got a lot done, but I would like to spend a little bit of time. Uh, me sells. Oh, okay, it's the hat. The hat message. Got it. I have to apologize for joking about Grandpa's old cottage when we first met. This is dear Farmer McThickums, your local carpenter, Robin. Yes, of course. Uh, LJ, thank you for the 23 months, and Chloe with the 11 months. How are you? How are you? Um, so we started our potato empire in the previous episode. Uh, we started fishing a lot. Uh, we might start going into the caves a little bit today as well. Um, kind of debating what I want to do. I want to definitely make the place a little bit prettier. Thankfully, we've got some rain today, so we don't need to do a lot. Um, we could maybe... I don't think we, we're nearly... We don't have enough money either. All right, yeah. I think we're going to go into the mines. There's a lot of different things we could do today. Uh, we could try and catch the catfish. But I think I think we have enough time to, to not have to worry about that right now. Because, uh, quite frankly, we're not going to catch the catfish. So we need we need to get the, the axe. We're going to go into the mines. Uncle Matt, thank you for the six months. And Sassy Packrat with the 12 months. Congrats on the purple corgi. How are you today? Whoops. Arena, good evening from Denmark. So excited to start you. Hail you. What it do? Joanna, how are you today? Saw the Barbie movie over the weekend. It was awesome. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah. Start strong. Go for the legend. Uh, you can't get the legend until you get uh, max fishing. There's a couple different ways we could try and get max fishing right off the bat. I don't think we would get it by the end of the season, though. We would have to invest a lot in um, crab traps, lots of lots of lots of crab traps and bait, which we could do. But I think I think it's going to behoove us to go into the mines right now. We can't get tier two. I didn't bring anything for energy either. Um, let's just see how far we can get down. That's all we're going to worry about right now. I should have checked to see if it was a good luck day or a bad luck day, too, in retrospect. You know what? Hindsight is twenty twenty, right? That's what they say. Jaylin, thank you for the 15 months. How are you? Working till late today. We'll watch the amazing stream tonight. See all amazing beans and tag. Hope the rest of the night goes well for you. I have a feeling our stairs are going to be down here. Nailed it. Coconutter, what it do? I mean, even if I just try and get five levels per day um, during spring, that's pretty good. I usually like getting down to um, gold. Well, as quick as possible. We'll see. We'll play it by ear. We'll see how we do. Bun cat, what it do? LJ, how are you? K bears, Lady Queen, GG. And so we need one more level. Oh, a free level and a. Ooh. Today must be a good day. Maybe we go for ten levels today. Also, pinned to the top of the chat is the link to the Safi Plush release. It doesn't release until August third. Um. But it is available there uh, to like make sure you get an email alert when it does release. It will only be available for 30 days, so keep an eye out on it. Once they're gone, they're gone forever. All right, so that was five levels. Let's let's go ahead and leave the mine. We'll do some fishing. We'll see how we're doing on energy for the rest of the day. Oh, QT, nice. Um, yeah, we'll fish. We can also fish for money, too. How did Caden's football game go? We actually didn't get to see a football game. Apparently his first football game is until mid-August. 
Um, so we just went up and hung out. We opened up some Pokemon cards. He lost his entire Pokemon binder um, on the flight back to Ohio. So uh, we surprised him with a new um, binder of Pokemon cards. We went and picked out some singles uh, before going and picked out some singles together with them. Opened up uh, uh, some packs of Pokemon cards and stuff together. So it was good. It was good. We hung out. Played some mini golf. Got some ice cream. You know, standard stuff. Will the plush sell out? Do we get to see the final look before the order? Um, yeah, so I've got images of it, and the plush, there will be as many plushes available as people want to buy, but once they're gone, like once this, the 30 days is over, you can no longer get it again. So they're limited edition in the fact that you can only buy them for 30 days and no other time ever. Boop, 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 boop. We still haven't unlocked the community center either. I thought we should have already. Or is it because it keeps raining? It sucks he lost his original collection. Yeah, he was super sad about it. Um, but uh, what does the plush look like? I can go. I can grab it. I'll grab it in a little bit. When I have to get another drink or something, I'll, I'll run and grab it. It looks amazing. It came out so good. It's smaller than the, the Aragon plush, but it is very cute. You have, you have to enter from the bus stop side at 8 a.m. on a sunny day. Okay, that's what I thought it was. So it has to be sunny day. It's been raining like every day, which is, I'm not complaining about. It's saving us a lot of energy. But we had some really, really good luck on the uh, the recent Pokemon stuff. We're going to open up some Obsidian Flames. I'll probably open up some on stream because we'll be playing Palia too. Um, so we're going to be playing a lot of Palia starting... We're going to be alternating between Palia, Stardew Valley, and maybe Baldur's Gate 3. Y'all have been trying to convince me to play it, and I have been resisting, but I think we might. So uh, uh, we'll see. But very excited for Polya. Uh, I'm actually a partner for Poly, a, a partnered content creator for Polya now, um, which is exciting. So we'll be starting sh those streams on August second, and we're obviously going to be making a guild. We're going to be doing events. I've got plenty of ideas for events for the game already too. Um, so really looking forward to it. Excited to see Polya. I signed up, but no email. I also have uh, an un. Well, I think I already revealed how many keys I have that I'll be able to give away for Polya too. Um, well, I don't know if I was supposed to. <laughs> I think I have them today, actually. I was supposed to get them today to give away. We'll have to do it over the next couple, uh, couple of days before release. Have I seen the box of packs of Pokemon they have at Costco? Actually, I haven't. I haven't been to a Costco in a very, very long time. Since before COVID. They want to be around all the people. Palia and Pal World both look awesome. Never heard of Pal World. So excited for Palia. Palia. Looking forward to those streams. Hail yeah. It'll be exciting. I'm definitely looking forward to it. Looking forward to our full... Like, this this playthrough of Stardew is going to last a long time, so... Um, we are never going to start a new playthrough of Stardew until this one is done. And I specifically did no mods, so that way I could always come back to this over time. And get our 100% playthrough. I think we might be able to do it in three, three game years. I know you can do it in two. I'm not confident that I can do it in two. Man, I think I missed bubbles. I thought it was just rain, but it might have actually been bubbles that I missed. Dang it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to fish as much as I can tonight, and we're going to sell our fish tomorrow. I would like to upgrade our rod as quick as possible to be able to use bait, because then we'll be able to optimize how much fish and how many levels we get. So it'll be good. I've seen uh, Paleo Pines. I have. I think I, I watched Kato play it a little bit, actually. Oh. 
I believe you get a fishing XP bonus if you get perfect. Hopefully you'll get your email soon. You should be getting them soon for sure. If not for the closed beta, definitely for the open beta. Closed beta starts the 2nd. The keys I have I think should be available for the closed beta. Open beta starts the 10th. No, we are not playing marbles to see who we marry last time. Y'all screwed me over last time with that. To be fair, I, I made it happen, but it's my choice this time. I want to live my best life. Um, so yeah, Polya is a farming game. Imagine if Stardew Valley and a 3D MMO, which is a massively multiplayer online game, RPG, whatever you want to call it, had a baby, and that baby popped out, and it was Palia. Palia. I keep mispronouncing the name. I'm sorry. I believe it's actually pronounced Palia. But I, I started calling it Palia before I ever heard the name, and now it's just kind of stuck in my brain. Normally a lurker, but I want to say I'm so excited for this new game challenge. I normally just watch the older plays. Ah, Candon. Glad to have you here with us. Ooh, Super Zoo story is going to be awesome, too. Very excited for that one. Maybe my most excited, cozy, like, farming sim, or zoo sim, I guess is what you would call it. Polly being compared to Fortnite engine, I think it's... <laughs> I think it's because it was made in the Epic Engine. Man, I am sucking it with the fishing right now. Dang. How many people can play Palia at once? It's a massively multiplayer online role-playing game. So, a yes number of people. I don't think we know how many people are on each server, though. Or how the servers are instanced. So that'll be very interesting. Um, I could probably get some more information on that, actually. <laughs> How's it doing? I see what you did there with the Stardew. Nice. Beardo Fed, thank you for coming to Bean, and Lighthawk with the 12 months. What'd it do? Alright, um... Let's eat the chub. Can you play Polya by yourself? Yeah, of course. messed up and accidentally exhausted myself. They have something that says there can be 25 people in the main town on one instance, but other locations may allow for more. If it's only 25, that'd be a crying freaking shame. That's like nobody. Soggy newspaper. Boop, boop, boop. Also, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to hit that like button if you do enjoy Stardew Valley. We got 500 people watching and less than 200 likes. Helps out so much. 25 does not equal MMO. <laughs> Definitely does not. But we'll get more information on it. Why algae is the same 
And the same level of energy as the cola. LJ. Hope you're well. Greets from Spain this time. I have my beautiful girl Nicole next to me. She's like Tina Turner's song, Simply the Best. <laughs> Love that wonderful woman. I hope y'all are having a fantastic trip. Thank you so much for the support. From all Spain this time, you say. Oh, God, I was so close to getting that perfect. God dang it. What a mess. All right, let's get out of here. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to start investing in the better fishing rod. So we're going to try and take as much fish. We're going to try and get five levels deeper into the mines if we don't have a bad luck day. Do I like the Diablo DLC? Um, I was liking it until I realized half the stuff is bugged out for Necromancer. Um, and now I'm just getting angry at the game because I'm not clearing as high as I should be. Uh, because things are broken. Oh my god, is it raining again? What kind of luck is this? The Queen of Sauce! Stir fry, it's a perfect way to get some healthy greens on your plate. Saute the greens in a little sesame oil and make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Now breathe deeply. Mm, that's good. <laughs> well, 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 well. Fortune teller, what do you got? Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Great. What it do, Tazzy? What it do, indeed? Finally able to catch a stream. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking stuff. Bring that to the dude place and the Clint things, and we'll do stuff for you. Uh, I guess who has to get their own bar in the casino on Friday? Wait. This bean? I'm so excited. God dang! We're actually gonna be making a trip to Vegas soon as a little uh, getaway before uh, at the end of the month before Starfield comes out. Lady Mojo freaking Jojo. What it do? What it do? All right, let's grab all our fish. Stanky little slimy boys. I'm gonna go sell them all. Gotta sell them all, fishy moan. We got a little bit of time. Let's navigate up to the, uh, the Northlands. Catch some more fish, and we'll head down south. Ms. Fineapple, how are you today? Hope you're having a good one, too. We're going fishing, baby. I'm going to try and not spend the entirety of the first year fishing, I promise. Or entirety of the first spring, I suppose. Avoid Vegas the last week of August. My company has a sales meeting there. Oh, no. Chris, you're going to be destroying the entire world. That was actually when we were going to go. <laughs> oh, no. Oh my god, I did spell plush wrong. Oh no. What a tragedy. Started bartending at the casino almost two years ago, and now get to bartend at my own bar. That's pretty awesome. Gotta make that big money. Hell yeah. If this is not the title. Ah, oh, I'm a mess. Good old dyslexia. Looked perfectly fine until somebody pointed it out to me. Vegas in August sounds awful. Well, the plan is not to walk around. I'll tell you that much. Eat it. I just want to eat it. I don't want to throw it away. Balls. Alright, well, we can get down... 
south anyways by the time the uh, the place opens. I'm well behaved. I can't speak to the behavior of the other 40,000 people with me. Oh, no. I mean, I say that like it's a lot of people, but to be fair, there's probably already way more than that there. But that's an additional 40,000 specifically on that weekend. That's a lot of people. Where are you all staying? That's the real question. Kara, glad to have you here. Some good old Stardew. It's a Sunday. Hopefully Willie's there. I'm going to be a real, real, really sad boy -o if he's not. Alright. Uh, fiberglass rod is the one we want. We are eight... We're 600 shy. Now, if memory serves, the most expensive, the best way to get fish is to fish in the pond, right? You can get the most fish in the pond, the large pond. Caesars and like four other hotels. Oh my god. We just got back from Vegas, went for a Final Fantasy Fan Fest. What the hell? There was a Final Fantasy Fan Fest? What? That's a thing? Hmm. Bubbles. It's so hard to tell sometimes what's bubbles and what's not, but these are just consistent. Consistency. I could try and catch the catfish. Uh, I feel like I'm just, I'm not like caught up on being good at fishing yet. I feel like I'm just going to fail horrendously. So. I think we'll be all right. I think I'm just going to wait until I get another level or so. At least until we get the, the fiberglass rod and then I'll try. Nice, Tazzy. Thanks for looking up for you. Hell yeah, that's awesome. This is an Exodus Conventions from Cali. <laughs> Kara, thank you for coming to Bean. Welcome. Welcome back. Oh, shoot. Oh, we got a Sandy Flapper. I realize that. I think we need that. Well, we actually have no idea what we need. Because we just decided to uh, go with the randomized boxes this time. Alright, let's see how much money we made from these. The only mod I kind of wish I did have was the one that can tell me how much things are worth before I go to the store. So close. Oh, Jackie, congratulations. It's amazing. one way to get energy, I guess. 
Come on, more halibut. Pfft. Or a sardine. Wait, pro tip for anyone who's starting a new playthrough. You can catch a catfish during the fishing tutorial if you get lucky enough to get one at the first casts. Just don't fish until the rainy day. The fishing tutorial. Oh, I guess that makes sense because you don't actually have to do the fishing tutorial on the docks. It's just your first cast, right? I mean, that'd be super unbelievably lucky to get that. Of the luck of the gods. God. Man, I'm really screwing up the energy, too. I keep getting myself exhausted. I think I'll be out for a steakhouse for his birthday and got a really important question. Ribeye, filet, mignon, New York strip, or a T-bone? With the ribeye. Go with the ribeye. A filet mignon is always good, but... Ribeye is really hard to screw up. A lot of places screw up a filet. New York Strip, I used to really like, but ribeye is definitely better. T-Bone's great, too. They're all, they're all pretty good options. All right, the fiberglass rod is Oz. And the rest of the money on bait. Oh, wait, we can't sell Willie's nasty bamboo pole back to him either, can we? We just have to keep it. Hmm. I could toss the rod, which we probably, which, you know what, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. All right. YOLO. We're going for the catfish, baby. There's an update for Stardew? Not yet. 1.6 is coming. We just don't know when. Just can't wait for Chocolatier, too. Too many good games coming? Oh, yeah. No, it's crazy. Oh, God. I exhausted myself again. Oh, God. Dang. What are you doing with your life? What is going on? Great. That means we're only going to recover half of our stamina tomorrow. Ugh. Lack of Red Bull. I'm tired in real life, so we drove. <laughs> I ate something bad on the way back from Ohio. So what was supposed to be a 10 and a half hour trip turned into like a 13 hour trip. So that was fun. And then I couldn't didn't sleep very well last night either. Um, so yeah. Clearly, my, my mental state at the moment is you're tired, so your character in-game should also be tired. Gas station sushi? I don't know. I'll tell you what, though. Never in my entire life I have been more afraid of crapping my pants. I thought I was going to die. I was in a sheer panic half of the trip. 
literally the worst. I was like, oh my god, there's no toilet for like the next 50 miles. I'm gonna die. Focus, focus. You are telling me to catch the catch fish like we're going to actually need it, even though we probably won't need it. Because we did randomize things, but I got it. Who's your daddy, you dirty little catfish piece of garbage? Me. I already watched the Queen of Sauce. It was the first thing I did today. Lord have mercy on my soul. I used my last piece of bait. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit. husband and I are doing a playthrough with our 7 and 10 year old it definitely gets interesting oh lord you didn't check the merchant why would I check the merchant I don't even know what I need right now all right so just to catch everybody up we have we have turned on the randomization of the community center items so yes there's a lot of things I could do and I could collect but I have no idea what I actually need so we're going to eat this catfish just to be spite. No, I'm not going to eat it. I am going to eat that bream. I'm going to eat this, though. But I swear to God, if I don't need a catfish... Ooh, daffodil. We need that. We need to collect as many of these as possible, actually. It just... Yeah. Also, it just keeps raining, so I haven't been able to unlock the community center yet. Trust me, I would if I could, ladies and gentlemen, but I can't. The struggle currently is for real, okay? But we'll get there. I've played a lot of Stardew. I'm not completely completely dumb yet with the Stardew. It's been a year since we last played. Since when can you randomize the community center? Since 1.5. It needs to be a sunny day, and we need to go there from the bus station. If it just has not been a sunny day, um, since the time we've been able to actually do it. Plus, technically, completing the community center in one year is not part of the challenge, although it is something I want to do. But I'm not going to be, like, super-duper terrified if we don't, you know? I'm going to try. But really, we just don't know what we need. Yet. So we're not going to worry about it. Out of sight, out of mind, you know? Oh, shoot, there's bats. Oh, God, no! <sighs> we're going to bed. God dang it. Y'all chose the wilderness freaking god dang map from hell. Level 4 fishing, though. Did we randomize the mine rewards? Yeah. Ooh, good human today. Okay, we can unlock the community center. Ah! Freaking birds. God dang. I'm gonna murder them all. Every last stupid freaking birdie one of them. I don't have any coal yet. Shoot. Eat in my gut. Faith! I know! I don't have any coal, Faith! Don't act like I don't know I need scarecrows. I know! I'm not a Stardew noob. I know I need some freaking scarecrows. I'm just a garbage human with no coal, okay? A 
I'm a dirty little garbage human. for eight. We're going to keep cleaning. I swear to God. Y'all a bunch of dirty backseat gaming. I'm going to murder each and every one of you. The only time I never used Scarecrows was like my first playthrough. And it's because I didn't want to use the coal on them, okay? Go watch the last playthrough. Scarecrows everywhere. And even then, I'm like, I don't really care. It's just like, like one or two plants. But at the beginning of the game, it definitely helped. I just got no coal, okay? I'm a dirty gremlin right now. And y'all are going to be like, don't slash the grass until you can get animals because you're going to waste your grass. I'm not going to waste the grass, okay? It's going to regrow. It regrows. I'm trying to make my farm pretty and majestic. I swear to God. Y'all going to make me lose my mind. Boop. It's going to be a hot minute before we get animals. field snacks. All right, let's go check out the community center. Oh, hi there. What's an eyesore? Maybe it wouldn't be an eyesore if you didn't steal all the money and make a statue of yourself, stupid garbage mayor. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now just look at it. It's shameful like you, you cheating floozy. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. And you'd rather be in Marnie's pants. But listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Georgia Corporation has been hounding me to sell them to the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to the relics of the past. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Gert! What it, dirt? Welcome. He just wants the vault, that's all. <laughs> Probably. What are we doing with the mayor's shorts this time? Oh, we're gonna put them in everything. Speaking of which, we need to go befriend Marnie before, uh, the luau so we can put it in the, the food. Oh, it's this. I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Am I gonna poison the mayor? I'm gonna poison the dude, bro. The governor or whatever his name is. Is he the mayor? I don't know. All right, let's see how screwed we got with these randomized community center bundles. You're worrying me, McThickums. Oh, you go worry yourself somewhere else. 
Uh, we definitely need to unlock the top hat this playthrough too. So that means, I think one of the first things we're going to try and unlock, maybe the dunes. Timothy, I have. The Expanse TV show is pretty good too. All right, let's see what we got. Now y'all can stop hounding me for not knowing thing. Oh, God dang it. Oh, uh, we got to go butt touch the wizard. <sighs> How do you unlock the top hat? You need to unlock the casino and buy it through making money in the casino. Crash Panda coming in hot. Bow. All right, so tomorrow we get to do the things. Today we got to do not the thing. We got to go water our plants though. We should gift Caroline the daffodil we don't have in our inventory. Got to do better about this. I've never befriended more than like two people without a mod. That is genuinely the thing that I am most concerned about with this playthrough is just having enough attention to care about anyone other than the person I'm trying to make babies with. Ah, uh, what are we doing? Wood. No, daffodil. Squirt that back there. We're going to water our plants. We should maybe get some iron bars. Maybe upgrading our watering can would be one of the most important things we could do quickly. We definitely don't have enough. Did I say iron copper? We need more copper bars. We just got to get our basic tool upgrades as quick as possible. It would behoove us to do that. Cookie! What a dookie! Just rescued a kitten that's like three weeks old. Aww. You want another cat? You can have your pick. Of tier. Or nugget. You can make a scarecrow now. It doesn't matter. I need two scarecrows because the way I built my crop plot. I literally built it the worst way possible. I was not thinking. So having one scarecrow would not help me right now. Oh, we can make two. We can make two. Okay, we're good. We're Gucci. Uh, let's do that. One, two. Yeah, because we need to put one. This is horrible, but we're going to do that. That'll be good enough for now. It's not ideal. It's not what I want. It's just what we got, okay? You can actually put one scarecrow. One scarecrow wouldn't be enough because there would be here would be messed up and here would be messed up. I think. We have one, two, three. Yeah, so one of, some of these would be messed up somewhere. catfish sell for you know what let's not get rid of the catfish let's see if it's gonna rain tomorrow though because that'll dictate if we uh, try and make some iron bars or something Another report it's gonna rain all day tomorrow baby and we need oh, let's go to the I guess we're gonna go dig Even though 50 energy, kind of worth it. Wait, man, I am struggling this playthrough. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
missing the game, you're making me want to play again, do it. Live your best life. All right, so I did promise a photo of the Safi plush. We'll do that in like 10 minutes. I'll go up and I'll get the Safi plush. I'll show you all what it looks like. I heard the, the creak of a door. Oh, we're gonna keep befriending him too. <laughs> Poor Caden. <laughs> you know what? We're just gonna make it till the end of the day. It's summertime. He can just have it till the end of the day. I got Caden a phone so he can call me, but he better call me. KC, what it do? Alright, we're gonna stick fish in our fish. You know what? Let's just fully regenerate. As much HP as we or health as we can right now. How many cats do I have? Too many. Is that an appropriate answer? I feel like it is. I thought for perfection you need to befriend everyone. Yup. Doesn't mean I can't have priorities though. Beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Hello, Demetrius. Just talk to everyone when you see them, it'll be easier. Oh, God. But if I don't see anybody for a couple days in a row, then they're going to hate me. Because their friendship degrades over time. Eleven. So I need five bars. It's five each. I need 25 kappa. It's going to be easier to befriend later. Yeah, I'm not super worried about... Oops. I'm not super worried about befriending them until I get rabbits. Once we get rabbits, we can just give everybody rabbits feet. And I feel like that's going to be... The best way. Until then, we're just going to talk to people as we see them. Give the best gifts that we have at the times. Like, we know we want to do daffodils for Caroline. Uh, pizza for Shane. Things for other people, I don't know, stuff. I can get down to level 10 today. Ooh, there was a cop of that. We need to friend our lover too. I don't know who we want to love. Who will accept our fish in the most loving way? You know, I don't know. I just know. We're going to need to rate the reactions to my fish. Not ah, Penny. Yeah, she hates our fish. Plus, she's the worst wife ever. I think she just wants us to die to steal the farm, honestly. Love no one in room with crow. Oh, no. We would get boned like this. We were not ready. Oh, just die. Oh, shoot. We're fine. This is great. This is fantastic. Exactly what I needed in my life right now. Oh, Christ on a muffin. Oh, you've got to be bloody kidding me. Come here. You motherless freaking goat piece of... Oh, there's another thick boy down here too? Ugh. We're gonna die. Yeah, just be inside of me. God, we need a better weapon. Stat. Go. Two more. No. Oh. Get into the wall. Shoot. 
Ooh. If something looks at us the wrong way, we're boned. <sighs> we might get enough iron bars today. Unfortunately, we're missing the rain. I wanted to get it done before it rained so that way we could not miss a day. But maybe we'll get lucky and it'll be rain two days in a row. Make sure there's no more copper because we need four more. Can I craft bombs yet? No, we just started. We're on day eight. Uh, work boots. Actually, that, that'll come in handy. That's, yeah, we randomized the rewards this time, so. playing with fire here. <laughs> that was an immediate Noposaurus Rex. Absolutely not. Boop, boop, boop. The speed debuff from the slimes is brutal. Oh god, it's been, like in the middle in the beginning of the game, the slimes, they're just they really are brutal at the beginning. Like once you get like a like one or two weapon upgrades is not so bad. But plus we have the wilderness problem too, so we know that we stand a chance of getting accosted on our farm when we go back at night too, so that's a problem. Think I'll play more Don't Starve? Yeah. Alright. I'm gonna go grab the Safi plush. I will be right back, so that way y'all can see it. Y'all requested it. I'll run upstairs, I'll be right back. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see here. Video camera. Excuse me. Baby, come back. The Safi plush. This is the new plush by Makeship. She's adorable. Look at the little toe beans. Got toe beans back there. So yeah. Safi Plush releases August 3rd. The link is pinned to the top of the chat. I'll put it in the description as well. Cute little tail. But yeah, it's adorable. Absolutely adorable. <laughs> All 
I need it in my life. <laughs> Makeshift does such a good job. Whoops. Weather report. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Holy crud, that's cute. <laughs> uh, let me copy this. I'll put it in the description. Because what you can do is it's not out yet. It'll be launched August 3rd, but you can put your email in there. That way you can get notified when the release actually happens. Which I highly recommend doing if you want one. Because they're only going to be available for 30 days. After that, they will no longer be available. There we go. All right, anyways, let's continue, shall we? Ah, oh, yes, Rasmodius. Let's go talk to the wizard. Cute aggression activate. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's so fluffy. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Stardew. Ugh. Brutality. Asmodeus, a seeker of the arcane truths. Mediary between the physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elementals. Keeper of the sacred. Ha, you get the point. Do I, though? Do I? And you, McThickums, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Here, I'd like to show you something. I don't know what kind of voice I'm doing for Dude Bro to this time. I don't know. Behold! An imprisoned Judamo. You've seen one before, haven't you? They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Cause you're the devil. All right, so let's let's drink a little bit of the forest juice, and we gotta go back to the community center so we know what we need. Farewell, sweet prince. Wait, is this not one? No, there we go. I was like, we gotta we gotta drink the forest juice still, right? The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. Yes, all of the gifts. You're in progress of marrying the wizard. Oh, with a mod. Mods do make everything get uh, better. Much better. What should I eat tonight? Y'all, my fate is up to you. Give me some good recommendations and then we'll run a poll. Because I'm a fatty cakes and I need some food and I'm hungry. So, tell me what I want to eat. You get to control my life today. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby ferns, moss grub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Steak, tacos, Alfredo, Taco Bell, sushi, lasagna. Man, where the hell am I going to order lasagna from? Ooh, brisket tacos. A nice salad. You're banned. Put user in timeout. <laughs> Freaking salad. Come in here with a salad, dances? 
You're gonna learn today. Mm -mm. Mac and cheese? Oh, okay. Get a frozen lasagna, then bake it. That's so much work. Or order from Olive Garden. Do they have do they have lasagna? Panera bread. So <laughs> I had to stop at about 50 Panera breads over the past like four days. Because every time we went to one, they were out of uh the green thing. Avocado. Which made the sandwich that Lexara wanted not good. <laughs> <laughs> so we went to like four different ones and they were out everywhere. There was a great avocado crisis across the world and nobody's talking about it. Forest juice or special mushroom soup? Maybe it's both. Buffalo chicken dip and lime chips? Oh. Oh, that does sound good. You only get their bread bowls? I got the Mighty Melt last time, which was okay. Their spicy chicken sandwich is interesting as well. They can't cook a freaking grilled cheese, right? Also, Panera Bread's menu is very confusing. I have never gone to a restaurant, like to a drive-thru before, looked at the menu and be like, I think I'm just going to leave. I don't know who designed that, but I do have to say, what the hell? I have two avocados at home. All this food talk is making me hungry now. I'm sorry. Panera bread. You know what? It does taste like hospital food. It really does. I remember liking Panera bread, but it's just bland. It's like food you would eat if you didn't like tasting things. Y'all made me order a Panera Bread breakfast sandwich, too. And I that's the only food I've never finished eating before. I don't like wasting food. But I had a Panera Bread breakfast sandwich. And I was like, this might be the worst thing I've ever put in my mouth. All right, what do we got? Grapes, spice berry, and sweet peas. What about for a spring forage bundle? This is exactly the same as always. Isn't it? Except for maybe the spring onion. This isn't mixed. This is exactly the same. I'm confused. Cheesecake Factory food is good, but will load you up with a week's worth of calories. Mm. Man, I haven't had Cheesecake Factory in a long time. <laughs> I'm doing good on drank. Thank you. What do we eat? My mom. God, my mom's a nice lady, okay? No holly instead of yam. How's your Diabloing going? How how far ahead of me are you already? God. Are this do you think the spring onions will be grown by now? Are you hungry yet? Ooh. Ooh. So lasagna does sound really good. Does that mean we have to we have to go to the store and make it though? I could do that. I'd be game for that. And then Diablo after. You got some Ooh, spring onion. That's wait, crab. There we go. Nice. See, I told lasagna is one of my favorite foods. I ordered a grilled cheese from Panera once, and they have me a sad microwave sandwich with slightly melted cheese in between. The betrayal was real. <laughs> Lexara gets a turkey, what turkey avocado BLT, which is pretty good. And so, what's the other thing that I need from here? The bundles are random. I notice the craft room is more likely to be the same as the original. That makes sense, though, because there's so few things that you can get. Oh, no, tear. I watched a vid on how to mod Stardew Valley. I was about to start and realized I don't even own it. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> oh no. Been abandoned. Cheesecake Factory Caesar salads are 2,000 calories. How does that happen? Most salads are actually way more calories than you would ever think. Most salads are worse for you than most foods you eat on a regular basis because y'all lather it with the... <laughs> to, to make a salad tasty, you either put a lot of nuts in there and a lot of dressing, completely defeating the purpose of eating a salad. Just live your best lives. If you want something to taste good, don't get a salad because it's going to be just as bad as the thing you would have eaten otherwise. Although I do like salads. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Boop, 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 boop. I mean, the crispy chicken needs to warm the green. Wait, what? Crispy chicken needs to warm the greens. <laughs> Um, okay, so we got the daffodil. We can complete our first bundle. And we should go find Caroline. Is it... It's dandelions for Caroline, not daffodils, right? I do really like Caesar salads, though. They're my favorite salads. But they're also just as much calories, if not more calories, than most other foods you'll eat. <laughs> Dandelions for Leah. Okay, that's what it was. Thank you. Grilled cheese with slices of tomatoes in the middle. I know it sounds weird, but trust me, it's good. I don't think that sounds weird. One of my favorite snacks is, uh... Cut up tomatoes with a... Salt and pepper. You can use mayonnaise, too. Uh, the spring seeds. Perfect. But I don't know why we keep talking about salads. I should ban all of you. <laughs> salads are not on the menu today. All right, so we need parsnips, green beans, cauliflower, and potatoes. That's different, right? I think the green bean is different. Hmm. Planning to go eat at the Cheesecake Factory on Saturday before going on a cruise Sunday to the Caribbean. Ooh, nice. What are these? A walleye, a tuna, a shad, and a largemouth bass. But they're all gold quality. Oh, that's the quality fish bundle. Alright, so we still needed the cat. This all seems exactly the same. Look at the other bundles. No, I'd rather die. We'll be alright. We shall survive. I am, however, debating. You know what? We're not gonna we're not gonna plant the spring seeds. We're gonna sell the spring seeds. Y'all about to lose everything. Talking about god dang salads. We've decided. I think we've decided on lasagna. Whoops. I meant to buy more potatoes. Well, we can buy the cauliflower that we need. Get that planted now. Let's just do that. You said I like salads? If I want to be really sad afterwards, yeah, I like a salad. If I want to be like, I wanted to feel healthy but still eat more calories than what I would have had otherwise, then yeah, I'll eat a salad. If I want to feel good for a moment than really sad afterwards... If I'm not going to get a salad, then I would just get, like, a lean protein 
and something other, something else that's really tasty and have way less calories and be more happy afterwards. All right, let's see where we're gonna do this. Let's do this over here. And then you're gonna eat that salad, but then you're gonna be hungry like an hour later and then you're gonna eat something else. Four, So let's go. Yeah, let's go to the mines. Yeah, instead of that salad, you could have a whole chocolate bar. That was my salad journey yesterday. Hungry one hour later. <laughs> Mind you, this lady... Also ordered a tuna sandwich, but no tuna. That's just called bread. Lasagna spaghetti flavored cake <laughs> with lots of cheese. Maybe she wanted mayo and cheese. Could I, mean, I suppose just order a grilled cheese though? You know, today must be a bad luck day. There's a lot of stuff down here. Why do we keep getting so many rainy days? I don't know. Like I'm both happy about it. Actually, I'm pretty happy about it. Especially in spring, it saves so much stamina. Would like to get down a couple more levels today. Oh, that's that's lame. Man! Turn around! Thank you. God. Ah. We're not going to get down to 15 today, <laughs> I don't think. We need to get a glow. Oh my god. Just go to the wall. Thank you. This lady just wants overpriced bread with a different name. <laughs> I'm a connoisseur of bread. Any bread will suffice, but with a different name. We've got too many different types of breads, too. Breads and milks. We need to stop. We need to stop milking things and we need to stop adding things to bread and renaming it. And we need to stop naming things art artisanal bread when we know dang well it's not made by hand. Bunch of liars. Oh Christ. It's another monster level. Um, man, 
monster levels with these rock crab things. Not my favorite. Can't wait for you to see the new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh my god, I forgot there's a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Oh no. I forgot about these bees too. Man, don't you tell me these new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are freaking lactose intolerant and they need freaking almond milk now. Or a special type of cheese pizza because they're going to fart everywhere. They're freaking turtles. I swear to God, did they ruin Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? I will riot. Don't you tell me they got freaking goat cheese pizza or something. I'm going to lose my mind. Oh, shoot. We need to go. Well, we're not getting down to 15 today. But really, though, when are we going to stop milking things? Like, we get a new type of milk every day. I can't even find regular milk in the grocery store anymore. Caden about rioted because I accidentally grabbed some kind of funky milk. Survival burger. Wait, what? Survival burger? Huh? Okay, the spirits feel neutral today. What about the weather? It's gonna be clear and sunny all day. Give me my potatoes! Oh, we got our cat today, finally, too. You see this cat here? This is your cat now. Pea milk? Okay, we're milking things. Wait, is it green? Please don't tell me somebody's drinking pea milk that isn't green, though, because that's really weird. Like, oh, I mean, I don't know what's weirder, drinking pea milk that's green or pea milk that's white. All right, we're going to stop talking about this. I hate all of this. All right, what are we naming our cat? We need a good cat name. Put some names in chat. Make them good names. They need to be good names, or I will ban every bad name. You'll be timed out for five minutes. Pea milk is thick, greenish, not really green. Ugh. Safi for the plush. All right, you know what? Safira. I like that. Nobody gets banned today. We're going through the process of re-education on the channel. <laughs> Give me them potatoes, baby. Why do we have some grown and some not grown, though? Interesting. All right, let's go get our, uh, uh, where'd I put the rest of the copper? Oh, uh, Fishlandia. Got it. Okay. We gotta go to Fishlandia. Have I decided on food? Lasagna. Like, Sara also wanted lasagna, so I feel like lasagna it is. Although she wants to make homemade lasagna. And while I do, maybe, 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 maybe. We'll see. Ooh, cookies. I definitely didn't plant these on different days like this. I don't know what happened. But I definitely 100, like, unless I was drunk the first stream, which I'm pretty sure I wasn't, there is no way in hell I planted different days like this. 
homemade is always 100% better. It is. We've made a lasagna before and it came out so good too. When they're done growing, am I going to redo the field? Yeah. Yeah. What if I was? Is Zara my cat? Wait, what? Yes, my cat is talking to me about making lasagna. I also make lasagna with my cat, which would be pretty fire. If I could have a cat that made lasagna, I would be so unbelievably excited. Lasagnas are just time consuming. It's really not that bad. You get some ricotta cheese. If you wanna, it depends on if you want meat in there too. But I mean, it's just sauce. Like I make my own sauce too. I don't do anything special with the cheese. Do you want Garfield? I would kill for Garfield. Me and Garfield are meant for each other. <laughs> I have many concerned if you started talking, taking requests from your cats and think you understand them. You know, me and Aragon have pretty in-depth conversations, though. Like, he even meows back to me, and I feel like I know what he's talking about. Like, we have full-blown conversations. It's, uh, it's a, maybe it's, maybe it's a problem. I don't know. I feel that's the least of his problems. <laughs> Cream cheese instead of ricotta. Wyatt, don't you do me like this. I'm fat enough already. Okay. I need to know how many of you have tried cream cheese in your lasagna instead of ricotta? I'm genuinely curious because I put cream cheese in my mashed potatoes too. Absolute fire. Cream cheese in your lasagna though. I mean, it makes sense. It would be creamier, tastier probably. Ricotta is not very tasty to begin with. Sorry, I'll never mention the salads again. That's right, you never will. <laughs> Dances. Thank you. I wasn't trying to be mean. It was a joke. We're re-educated. We gotta, we gotta make sure we never talk about salads again. But you just talked about salads again. Oh, I'm dumb. I came here... Oh, God, I need to make a thing. I need to make a thing. The forge. We need to make a forge. I love ricotta. Ricotta for life. Banned. <laughs> Valenia, how you been, by the way? Mm, mm, mm. Proof. We need a cooking stream. I, I gave away all my cooking stream cameras. We'll do them again for sure. 100%. Um, but right now, I've been just a dirty little gremlin. My house looks a hot mess. I gave a camera to Bo and I gave a camera to Keontae. And now I only, oh, Pierre, you suck. Good, busy with work, Valenia. You made a, I thought that said desert, but it's a dessert lasagna. I think that's called a pie. I'm no scientist or anything, but pretty sure that's called a pie. Go put a potato in your bundle? I will never. Disgusting. But yes, we will. All right, how do we make a forge? We need 20, oh my God, and all my copper ore, son of a. Just when you think you've made it ahead, the game is like, not today. Not today. We're gonna ruin everything. We're gonna go back to the freaking mines. <sighs> Let's put this in storage. Gonna keep that for energy. We're gonna go give the daffodil to Caroline. We need to save the rest of our money for, uh, we need to start saving up for strawberries is honestly what we need to do. Mm -mm -mm. 
isn't copper in your fishing box? No, I grabbed it already. I had to use it all to, uh, to build a furnace. All right, you dirty little potato thieves. We need beans and parsnips as well. I make baked spaghetti with cottage cheese and about four other cheeses. I don't know if that's called baked spaghetti anymore. I feel like that's called... What's that thing when you put it all in a, like a dish and you put cheese in it? Called ziti? I don't know. I don't remember things very well. But I guess that wouldn't be with noodles, right? That'd be with actual ziti, baked ziti. <gasps> Friend. A casserole. Thank you. I have to go to Caroline, too. Let's go find Caroline. Where is Caroline around 2 o'clock? A ZD or a casserole? You're going to make mochi donuts later? <gasps> Ooh. That's exciting. Brianna, how are you doing? She might be stuck in the general store. Look at that dirty little mare. I'm going. Ah! Uh. Eating a salad with spicy chickpeas? Banned! With those chickpeas, that salad is more calories than a tasty treat you could have had. Man, we've just been over this. Oh my god. What kind of dressing did you put on it? A creamy, creamy dressing full of tasty treats? You did, didn't you? What'd I do for dinner? I forgot dinner and now I need to dinner. Uh, uh Lasagna? Did I decide what I was going to do for dinner? Mm, not quite. Kind of lasagna, but kind of also maybe not lasagna. I used to eat my salads with no dressing. I do. When I have a salad, I don't have dressing anymore. Maybe. Like, I used to love ranch and the stuff you use for a, uh... A, uh, thingamaboob. A uh, chicken Caesar salad. But now if I, if I have a salad, maybe a little bit of, like, a... Like a vinaigrette or something like that. But usually just... A naked salad. It's the only way it's healthy. Or if you like uh, stir fry some chicken, you can the flavor of the chicken and mix it up real good. You can get a little bit of that flavor on the on the greens, you know. Sadly, you're allergic to lasagna. Just specifically and only lasagna, huh? Ooh, studs, nice. What's this? How you doing? A lamb. So it's always like gyro or hero or gyro or thingy and some baklava. Man, I haven't had baklava, baklava in a hot minute. Oh, son of a. I'm just never getting down in the mines is what's been decided. Put a mix of olive oil and balsamic on your salad. Very healthy. Indeed. Indeed. It's getting hungrier by the minute. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Give me some stairs. Man, who do I got to blow for some stairs right now? Yeah, they're 
gonna be right at the entrance, aren't they? tragedy an absolute tragedy I'm gonna save those cookies start making some stairs or something. <laughs> Seems like getting to level 15 is the bane of our existence at the moment. Right. Be right back. Boop, 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 boop. Regular sprinkler. Right, and welcome, welcome, welcome. $2,800. We gotta save all that money for strawberries. <laughs> Shut up, you dirty little chicken. Cloudy with a light breeze. Living off the land now, baby. What you got, fortune teller? Very displeased today. Great. Fantastic. Okay, we gotta find the thing for Robin. Go ahead and s we're gonna sell our potatoes today. The potato king, the potatoes, they're just the creme de la creme. The best way to make money in the game. We don't need money today, so I'm just gonna actually, we're not even gonna bother going to Pierre's. Other than the fact that we do need to buy at least a bean and a parsnip. How many days do we have? It's this weekend, right? Sunday is uh, is the day. We basically need to get beans and strawberries planted at the same time. Have you thought about trying the Rags to Riches Animal Crossing challenge? I'm thinking about it. You mean playing Animal Crossing 
like it's Animal Crossing because it's literally what you do. I mean, no offense. I know Animal Crossing creators are trying to find any possible way to make something exciting. But the fact of the matter is, it's <laughs> it's just Animal Crossing and there's not much else you can do about it. It's not like Sims where you can actually use like mods and things like that to really change things up. Like it's just it's just Animal Crossing. You can make a new name for whatever playthrough you're doing, but it's still just Animal Crossing. Ah, shoot. Hold on. I forgot the energy stuff. Plus, the demons are very displeased today. Don't forget to give Caroline the daffodil. Yeah, we gotta do that too. You thought it sounded fun? Look, if you want to play Animal Crossing, you don't need a reason to play it. Just play it. Like, that's the whole point of games. Just play it. Boop, 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 and have fun. Live your best life. That's the best thing about games. You don't need a reason to enjoy something. Animal Crossing Battle Royale coming to console near you. Love Animal Crossing, don't get me wrong. Or you could play like one of the old Animal Crossings. <clears throat> play the OG, get an emulator on. You can play. You can play the emulator on like a poo poo PC. You just need something for in between Dreamlight Valley. Poly uh, comes out. The closed beta starts on the second. And the open beta starts on the 10th. If you need something, I recommend checking that out. People just can't move on from games sometimes. I mean, that's that's a lot of people. That's why the... Well, that's the thing that I, that I like doing. I mean, it's one of the reasons why my channel will never be, like, super duper unbelievably successful. Because I always play whatever my heart desires. Oh, there's just so many, so many good games out there. You can like the GameCube on my phone? Nice. Wish I'd gotten an invite to the closed beta. I have uh, 25 keys to give away. Actually, let me check my mail. I'll be giving them away through Discord to members. Oh, Caroline, where are you? I forgot the daffodil. God dang it. I do wish we could have finished La Hamelia. Well, it was never really planned. It just happened. As all good things, though, it just it just happened. It was never even meant to be. I don't even remember how it started. Oh, it was because of the uh, the the Animal Crossing DLC, and that Marlow is how it all happened. And it just happened naturally, which is how most things that I enjoy happen. Is Polya PC only? The open and closed beta is yes, but the game will be releasing on the Switch as well. Hmm. Oh, we about to steer Pierre's waifu. Maybe not. We have no hearts with anybody yet. We watch you play, Paulia? Yeah, we'll be playing on the second. Two days. Two days. Then we'll be playing some Paulia. I feel like maybe we should do a little bit of fishing to try and get some more money for, uh... I really want to get more copper, too. All right. No, we need, we need money. We need money more than we need anything else. Uh, let's go do that. We're gonna go fishing for the rest of the day. At 
Lee is the only de decent wife. Haley is too full of herself. Penny is a chump. Emily is a weirdo. And Abigail seems too young. I mean, having a weirdo in your life is one of the best things ever. Okay? Like, you need somebody to spice up your life a little bit. There ain't nothing wrong with getting a little weird. I have no pole tag. Thank you, Denise. I would have never noticed from my empty bar and me running to my farm to pick up. Oh, wow. Wait, hold on. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Do, 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 do. Everyone was weird in their own way. Everybody is weird in their own way. If we all just allowed ourselves to be weird, then we would all find the of the people to be weird with. But we all hide our weirdness. We all want to pretend like we're not weird, but we're all freaking weird. Y'all got some weird stuff you be hiding from people. I know it. Y'all a bunch of freaks out there. Stamp, just get Taco Bell. Pour one out for Pee Wee Herman. Oh, somebody did just mention mention that. Rest in spaghetti, never forgetty. Stamp, I hope you get some good food. <laughs> Gregory. Get a taco pizza? I'm good. Oh, no. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Get in my mouth. Oh, God dang it. Denny's has a pancake taco. How does that even work? Is it like a pancake on the outside? And taco stuff on the inside? That was the most exhilarating fishing experience of my life. Do that. Oh, I feel like that's too much soft stuff. You need a little bit of crunch. I mean, I do love soft shell tacos too, but like a soft shell with a hard shell is to get the soft and the crunch at the same time. But a can a pancake feels like it's too much, unless it's a super thin pancake. But if you got a fluffy pancake with taco stuff in the middle, it's just not enough, you know? I have not found out if Polya is playable on a Steam Deck, but I'm sure if you Googled, is Polya playable on the Steam Deck, you'll probably get a pretty solid answer. I feel like it could and should be. Is it, though? I, have, I, haven't, I haven't actually researched it myself. I could probably find out right now, though. But if you would if you would Google it for me and tell me, I would appreciate it. Cause, Cause I got fishing to do. You can't get an answer from Polya? Man, I gotta teach y'all how to Google stuff. Polya Steam Deck. R slash Polya. 
wondering if the game will work on my Steam Deck. Seeing the full release is less than six. <laughs> running through alternative means on Steam Deck. You can download directly from Steam Deck. That's Linux. No need to copy from another OS. You can use it that way you said or with Lyra. So you gotta go to the website and download it on Steam Deck. Yeah. So probably yes. Do we have a tutorial to do it? No. We'll probably have a tutorial within the next week. Once the full like the full beta releases out. Uh, Katie, when there is a gift sub, all you got to do is just um, click the allow gift subs. I'll do some in a little bit. If we get to 500 likes, I will gift 20 gift subs right now. Y'all have one minute to get us to 500 likes and I will gift 20 gift memberships right now. Well, after a minute. We're at like 300, so it's like 200 of you out there just have to tap one button. And help some people out. <laughs> Bruh, 500? Bruh! 20 gift subs, that's 100 bucks. That's more I'm going to make from the stream. Easy. <laughs> only need like 75 more. See, look. It only takes a second. <laughs> I wish I could like a stream multiple times. Go back to Reddit Orange Room 2? No, your mom told me not to. Where are all the fish? 40 more likes for 20 gift memberships. All oh, snap. Oh, oh God. Wait, I want to get the reward. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Need 30? 30 more. Ooh, the mother catch from a chub. Excuse me? Still can't believe you're getting the the red dead orange from two comments. I I mean it's one of my favorite games of all time. How much gifts for you to go to Red Dead Orange from two right now? Uh, five hundred gift subs and I'll play it right now. All those thank you for coming to Bean. Welcome to the community. And I'll donate that to charity. Ah. Alright, last fish. Last fish and 10 more likes and we'll do 20 gift. Oh, son of a beached whale. People, people love watching Stardew. It's one of my... It's, it's definitely in my top five, along with Red Dead, Animal Crossing. Oh, it's really hard for me to make, like, a top list of my favorite games because, like, each game fulfills its own... God dang it, we're not going to catch another fish. we got to go. Because the your mom joke. <laughs> well, welcome, Hollows. 501... Oh snap. All right, let me get let me get to the house, okay? Let me get to the house and I'll do the gift memberships. Isn't Red Dead Online dead? Yeah. Uh Rockstar has pretty much already said that they're not going to support it other than just keeping the servers online, which we all knew. 
Like Rockstar, like they just make too much money from GTA. So logically speaking, from a corporation that is beholden to shareholders, taking resources away is just not a thing they're going to do. All right. Anyways, we did it. We made it home. So I got to go to YouTube. Got to go to my own stream. Got to click pause. And we got to gift memberships. 20. 100 doll hairs. Boom. All right. All the new members. Also, all the new members, make sure to join the members Discord. Because if you are interested in playing Palia with all of us, that releases the closed beta releases the second, open beta uh, releases the 10th. We're going to be playing with members of the community. I also have 25 closed beta keys to give away, so that way you all can play with us. I'll be giving those away in our Discord. So if you're a new or returning member from, oh my god, Gregory, thank you so much for the 20 gift memberships as well. Thank you so much. And Dawson, thank you for the 17 months. If you're a new member, make sure to join the members only Discord. We do uh, members game nights. We're going to actually do ours this week as well. Because uh, we were gone last week, so we got to do it this week. Um, but yeah, so. Make sure to come hang out with us. Look at all them new members. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, heck. What do we got going on here? Tomorrow is the Egg Freaking Festival. Which means also the day we got to get all of our strawberries. Let's see what kind of luck day. Because if we have a bad luck day, we're not going to fish again. Or go to the mines, for that matter. Spirits are very happy today. Okay, so it's going to be both a good mines and good fishing day. If Polya didn't become available around the same time as Baldur's Gate 3, I might be interested. Well, uh, Polya is free, Kiosna. Torrens, what do you do? Can I answer your question? Uh, what is I? Yes, although I just answered it. <laughs> I try and read all of chat, but if you just put your question in there, eventually I'll answer it. Unless it's something that's like inappropriate, then I won't. Does it matter which membership you pick to play Polly with members? Um. Technically, no, but depending on how things play out, I'll have to prioritize. So I just found out. So let's put it this way. Anybody that's a member will get into the guild. But if we can only have 25 people in a group at a time doing something, then we're going to prioritize the um, super bean and above for that. Uh, but anybody that is a member will get into our guild. Because the, technically the bean tier isn't supposed to exist. We did it as a test, uh, but I kept it because uh, I felt like it was good to keep. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. But uh, that's the same reason as uh, as why the, the super bean tier still has the rewards, because uh, most times you're only limited to like 300 friends or something like that, so... Can I make a snazzy Discord stuff for a polio section? Apps of freaking Luli. <gasps> Oops. And I think we did decide that we're going to play Baldur's Gate as well. Here, yeah, fishy, 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 fishy. We should be able to make another thousand bucks today to get us even more strawberries. Ah, Tony, welcome officially back to the community as a super bean. Look at that blue corgi. Hell yeah. Did I see how many different endings Baldur Gate 3 has? Yeah. But when something has 70,000 different endings, 
they probably don't matter that much. If I'm going to be quite honest. Like, it's exciting, but when you have something that has 70,000 different endings, what is it, just 70,000 different texts that you that you get to read? Like, it's not like it's 70,000 different cutscenes with, with a drastically different story. You get probably 70,000 different sentences, which... Because there's no way a company can do 70,000 in-depth, true, absolutely crazy, unique endings. Play the stress test for Palio. Super excited. Hell yeah. Do I remember liking Sunhaven? Yeah, absolutely. I heard it didn't get as much love as it deserved, though. What is Polya about? Imagine if Stardew Valley and like a 3D like if Stardew Valley and an MMO had a baby that's what Polya is supposed to be. Gregory, thank you again. Thank you very much. grounded again. I just, don't, I just don't know when. I think there's another big update planned and we'll probably play it then. Just got One Lonely Outpost. I've been looking at it. Uh, what do you think? Have you... Who has played One Lonely Outpost? Is it worth playing? Usually I'm the one to give reviews, but... Let's go. He answered me. I answer better when chat's not being spammed with the question. Once chat starts being spammed, then I get really annoyed, and I don't respond. Because I don't want to encourage spamming to have an answer questioned. A question answered. You know, words. Come here, Caroline. Get your flower. Words are hard. Indeed, they are. Ooh, Kaylee, I've seen Islanders. Looks good. Take my fish, you dirty man. Any bubbles? Oh, I just realized what time it was. Any tips for fishing on the Switch? <laughs> Pray. Just practice, really. Just practice tapping the button. 
You'll get used to it. It sucks at first. But once you get used to the tapping to balance it, uh, it's not so bad. Definitely don't hold it. Tap it. Am I still working? I am cow. I have not in a very, very, very long time. I have to redo the whole game pretty much. Um, I very, very much want to to work on the true version of the game. Like I showed you guys I am cow, but it was like the preparation for learning how to make the game I wanted to make. Um, long story short, I haven't worked on it in, it's been like, what, a year now? But eventually, yes. Just want to get enough for 6,000. Perfect. Okay. Tend to hear that Polio servers max at 25 players. Yeah, very, very surprised about that. Uh, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, we are past the two-hour mark. I really do hope you enjoyed today's Stardew Valley playthrough. Uh, tomorrow we got Egg Festival. We got strawberries. It's gonna be a good day. We're gonna be we're gonna stream more Stardew tomorrow. Um, Wednesday we start Palia as well, so we're gonna be doing two days. We'll do Stardew and Palia maybe. Um, new members, make sure to join the members only discord. There will be a link in the description as well as in the like rewards. If you click join, you can see all the rewards you have for being a member. Um, make sure to check that out. We got the, the Safi plush release. If you haven't already link in the description for the Safi plush release, August 3rd, it'll only be available for thir Oh, why does that not work? Um, it will only be available for 30 days. Back. There we go. It'll only be available for 30 days. Made by Makeship. Absolutely amazing quality. Link in the description for the Safi plush. Destroyer of Worlds. Goes with the Aragon plush if you got that last time. But anyways, I do hope you all have a wonderful night. Thank you so much for hanging out. And I'll see you all in the next one.